Welcome. I'm Stephanie Vaughn, and I have my colleague Sadaya Vital with us today, um, with me today, and we are going to talk about being part of the new SIG, Advancing Science and Practice for ARN, and we are representing Cohort 1. I'm, uh, as I mentioned, I'm Stephanie Vaughn. I'm a professor emeritus at Cal State Fullerton and also a clinical nurse specialist at Encompass Health. Rehabilitation Hospital of Tustin, California. Sadalia. Hi everyone. My name is Sadalia Vital, and I'm currently working at Encompass Health. I'm a chief nursing officer, but I also have a PhD from the University of Massachusetts Amherst and I'm adjunct faculty at UMass Amherst as well. I'm glad to be here today and I'm excited to talk to you about our cohort number one. And we'll start with sharing a, a little small PowerPoint with you so you understand a little bit more about what the SIG is about and how we can support evidence-based practice at the bedside. Wonderful. Well, thank you. Well, as we mentioned, the name of our the name of our SIG is now it used to be the research SIG, and it's now advancing science and practice. And we are representing cohort one. I'm going to try to make this uh, to it's where it's a full screen here. Okay. So what's a, what's a little bit about our cohort one, Sadalia? Sure, I'd love to share that with everyone. So our, our overarching goal is really to connect people who are interested but not actively engaged in evidence-based practice or quality improvement or even research and really want a desire to improve patient care and outcomes at the bedside. Wonderful. Well, our objectives for this, uh, to go into a little bit more of what we'd like to accomplish, is we'd like to help you um, define evidence-based practice and how it applies to the clinical setting. We also want to find out what your perceived facilitators and barriers are to implementing evidence-based practice in your um, organization or facility. And, and last but not least, we'd like to help you develop a very well-structured PICO question um, to really uh, about an issue that you're very passionate about or something that is a problem in your facility. We meet quarterly as a group and we would be really excited to have you part of the committee. Um, we will be talking more about those objectives at each meeting and will help hopefully facilitate some barriers uh, or support you through some best practices and get to know each one of you individually. So we look forward to as co-chairs of this SIG to share our expertise with you and hopefully advance nursing science at the bedside. Absolutely. And along with that best practice, hopefully we'll share a little bit of some of the QI projects and maybe even research pro projects that we've done over the years um, to help you maybe jumpstart a project of your own. We've actually added our both of our um, email addresses, so we look forward to um, any questions that you might have about cohort one or about the committee, and we will be contacting shortly about when we will meet, but it will be um, in mid-February. Thank you so much. Thank you.